This is so freaking fun, man. Yikes. And that's what I didn't want to happen. I don't know this ever came out. So, I'm pretty much told myself that I'm done with reviews because like, first of all, I kind of suck at them. There's a lot of like zooming in and like camera work. If you want to get a good one, it's not for me. So the only time I'm going to review things is either like things that I use all the time that I can like show you that are cool, like the Toa motors or some kind of, you know, frame or something. Or if something new comes out that I'm literally obsessed with, like this guy, I'll do a review. This is the first HD toothpick and the first real HD toothpick that flies like a toothpick, not some big old hunky HD micro. This is a toothpick, a super light, like 120 gram with the battery toothpick that is 4S. So this is definitely the first 4S HD toothpick. I could say that, how about that? And this thing is sick. Um, I'm obsessed with it. So it's the, obviously let's get this out the way. It's the GEP RC HD3, uh, Skip HD, GEP RC Skip H3. Um, I've been waiting for something like this to come out where it is, it actually flies good. No jello and all that. It's a toothpick. I didn't really care if it was a toothpick, but I cared if it was small and it's not a Cinewhoop. So I can, you know, I, I won't get carried away by my ducts in the wind. The first few times I tried to arm it, uh, it flew away. That was because I was using a 650 milliamp battery and I shouldn't have. Oh, so it also runs 3S, but if you put 4S, make sure to use these um, bi-blade gem fans that it comes with because the, the three blades may uh, burn your motor or ESC. But this thing flies exactly like a five inch. If you put this, gave me side by side video of this and a five inch and they were the same quality and on mute, I probably wouldn't be able to tell the difference because this thing does power loops, you know, whatever you need. Matty flips, coming out, <laughs> gap shooting, juicy flicks, all type of shit. And I just can't believe how it flies. Jello free and I'm told the jello so i'm not a like a micro expert but i'm told because of the way that this tpu shell is and the camera's mounted into that and that's mounted into the uh frame with whatever they have going on here that that's what stops the jello but yeah dude this thing has power flies for five minutes five minutes man 4s 450 milliamp pack not to add too many awesome things to the table but for some reason, Banggood has this in stock in the US and mine got to me in three days. They shipped from a US warehouse. So comes with FR Sky to bind it. All I did was dude, press this little button. Everything's out of frame, huh? <laughs> press this little button and I was good to go in there. And it bound up and it has excellent reception. I, like I can fly, I basically I haven't pushed it, but Anywhere around my house that I fly my five inch, this baby did with 70% RSSI or more. Um, yeah, so I, I have wrecked this a couple times. <laughs> that arm is damaged. <laughs> this motor is damaged. <laughs> but everything is still butter. And that is something that I didn't, I had heard that because micros are so light, you can crash them and stuff, but I guess I learned firsthand that uh, it's true. So it comes with like motor screws, obviously, extra strap, screwdriver. It comes with these little protectors, which is really sick for the uh, RX antenna. As you can see, I've already broken mine. I wanted to make to document some of this before I blow this thing up because I've been crashing it left and right. Still flies amazing. Um, comes with these little foam things for landing pads. You cut them. They give you plenty. So you can put them there. You could use it for a battery pad, but I use something else. Sorbethane. Um, little M2 or M4 wrench. Uh, two sets of gem fan by blades. And the remote for the Caddx Baby Turtle. Kebab, when I watch his review of this, he is one of the most skeptical people. And he said it was, I think he said it was his favorite uh, HD toothpick. He said that he hasn't made one yet because it's like too heavy or something, but this is one of the best ones on the market and 
he was flying his on 3S. Imagine if he would have popped it on 4S. So check out the link. If you just want to go grab it, you can't go wrong with this, dude. You cannot go wrong with this. This thing is so sick. Uh, uh, uh.